tomorrow is world champs. Ah, uh, didn't focus on your face. Oh, no. That's fine. Day one. Day one. Done. Let's go. Hello, and welcome to the 2023 World Rowing Championships here in Belgrade, Serbia on Sava Lake. Oh, hey. hey, mate. I remember you, how are you? We have racing from September 3rd through September 10th. This year is important because it is Olympic qualification year. Paris 2024 games will only have 502 athletes, 251 men, 251 women. That includes Coxon. So only a certain number of places will qualify the boat, not the athletes, for the Olympic team next year. We should be having some pretty great weather all week. Uh, low winds, highish temps in the 80s, or 20s. We have over 950 rowers, 455 boats, and 73 countries represented here. And that's not excluding people who have scratched, that's probably a little bit lower. Our highest subscribed events are the men's singles and women's singles. We have 48 men, 32 women, and the lowest subscribed events are the lightweight pairs and quads. So kind of expected with the way lightweight rowing and the direction that is being taken. So unfortunate, but that's just how it goes. So there are 502 athletes that are able to compete in the Paris games. This year, we have nine spots for the singles, 11 spots for doubles, seven spots for light doubles, pairs get 11 spots, quads get seven spots, fours, sevens, and the eights, five spots. Really, really, really intense thing this week is if you get into the A final, essentially. So if you can get into the A final, you've cleared the first bar of qualifying your boat for the Olympics, and then you can go for a world throwing <laughs> medal. But if you get into the B final, that's when you have to make sure you're not in a certain place, unless you're in the eights. Last place in the eights, do not qualify, so those will be intense spots. Got sixth in the 2019 World Championships was New Zealand. They went and qualified at the final Olympic qualification regatta, and then they went and won the Olympics, so it's possible. So on the Paris side, we have seven spots for the PR1 singles, uh, six spots for the PR2 mixed double, six spots for the PR3 mixed double, and six spots for the PR3 mixed cox four. Getting into the A final, is huge. And we'll have some of our boats get into the A final uh, tomorrow, which is crazy to know that you're going to the Olympics on the first day of World Rowing Championships. Today, we've already had some racing, actually. We had the spare pair races. Uh, we had the men and women singles. So GB in New Zealand won their heats. The women singles, US won, swept. So go on Maggie and Audrey. US and Netherlands in the women's pair. And then Australia and Serbia in the men's pair. Pretty exciting. Everyone's getting really hyped. Sun is setting. It's gorgeous here. A little bit hot for my liking. I'll be all kitted up in sun protection gear. This whole week we'll be bringing you interviews, crispy B-roll. I'll be taking my actual photo camera and taking some photos of racing since I can't film racing or prize giving. So hopefully making a video a day for the entire week talking about all the crazy racing that happens. I'm about an hour walk from my Airbnb so I gotta start walking back that way soon after opening ceremonies. Looks like we're about ready to begin though so I'm gonna wrap up here. My name's Eamon Glavin. Welcome to the Rowing Network. Hope you enjoy our coverage this week. See ya. Get the shot, Ben. Get the shot. I want you to fulfill your dreams, go to Paris, and win it all. Danas i narednih dana okupit će se sve najbolje što donosi svetski veslački sport. City of Belgrade is a center of world rowing these days, and it will bring the best to you. I declare the 2023 World Rowing Championships, Belgrade, Serbia, open.